very excited today to introduce to you the Crayola Dry Erase colored pencils. That's right, I said colored pencils for your dry erase board. So this will work on any dry erase surface. So whether it's a melamine, a porcelain, glass, doesn't matter, these pencils will work. So let me show you, this is a pencil, looks just like colored pencil you'd expect, except for it. this writes on dry erase boards. Now, they will come unsharpened because they are heat sensitive, so try not to leave them out in the heat where they could melt. Um, but there are a few things that I love about these pencils. First of all, no funky smell. A lot of times if you're working on dry erase boards all day, those pens can get overpowering. So this doesn't smell like anything. <laughs> you could write with this all day, not get a headache going to be just fine. The other thing I like about this is if you happen to get these on your clothes, this is Crayola folks, they're washable. I love that as a mom. Um, also as a mom, I like that my daughter can practice her handwriting, her numbers. She can practice writing overall with something that is the size of an actual pencil instead of those big fat pens. It's good for her fine motor skills um, so that she can get used to holding and writing with this size utensil. The other thing that we like to do at home is uh, we've taken just an Avery peel and stick dry erase surface here and um, attached it to a binder to make uh, a homemade, I guess, lap board um, where she can practice her letters and her numbers and hearts because she's a five-year-old little girl. <laughs> and as you can see, this stuff doesn't just wipe off. Um, so she can, even if she wanted to come back up here, it's not going to erase the stuff that she's done before. Um, and if she makes a pretty, pretty picture and accidentally rubs across it, there is no drama. <laughs> now, in order to get this off really, really simple, you can just use your dry erase marker. You may need to apply just a little bit more pressure because it's not, like we said, like those dry erase markers. Well, if you hit it with your elbow, it's just gone. Um, there's some there's some tackiness here, so it's going to stick. Um, if you purchase the crayons, it comes with a cloth. So you can also just use a cloth to erase. Now. My daughter, being a five-year-old, and they've got creative little minds, also discovered that if you use a little water, you can wash that off. And she discovered it by doing this. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure if you just used water and a cloth, that would probably work just as well. Now, um, I will tell you that these are AP certified, non-toxic. So if uh, you have some child that likes to chew on things, that's OK. If you have any questions on these dry erase markers or anything else, give our awesome team a call here. We'd love to talk to you.